Hey guys, Tom here with CellPhoneTrek.com and today we have the review of the T249 uh, Samsung device for the T-Mobile network. It's a prepaid device. Uh, you can also buy it with a two-year contract at a reduced price as well. Um, pretty simple feature phone, uh, nice sliding action. We'll go ahead and show you that in the review and uh, easy, colorful display. Overall, a very nice device for a feature phone. So let's jump into the review. All right, here's the device itself. As I said, a sliding device to reveal the uh, T9 layout keyboard. Accept call, end call, back button, soft keys. Multi-directional pad with center OK key. On the left-hand side, we have volume rocker bar and a micro SD card slot. Holds up to a 16 gigabyte micro SD card. It's uh, great for music, uh, things of that nature. Dedicated camera key, uh, 1.3 megapixel camera here on the back. And we also have the micro USB charging port, which also doubles as your headset jack. There's a little headset picture right there. And so if you have a micro USB headset, you stick it in there and you can listen to your music, um, things of that nature. And you also have a speakerphone here on the back. So as you can tell, we have different options here. We see web to go. Um, you have your menu here. We'll go into your menu. You have uh, your carousel style thing, starting with call history, people, messaging, uh, media, and your settings and your organizer here. So you have six different windows. Let's show you here settings. Settings, you can go ahead and personalize different things. Uh, your account, Bluetooth settings, call settings, advanced. You can reset all your settings, information about the phone, and that's about it. Go here into your media. Here's your web to go, uh, your games and apps, uh, certain sounds, images, your photos, uh, your music, your music player. Pretty simple music player. There's nothing in, there's no music in here, but um, you organize your playlist from all your different music that you have, but there's no music. You can put music on the micro SD card or you should be able to transfer it uh, directly onto the phone using a micro USB data cable. Uh, there's games, you can find great games, uh, the best apps or your games. It tells you how many games are inside there, three. You have a Texas Hold'em demo, Midnight Pool demo, and a Tetris demo. There are options in all three of these games, so you can go ahead and uh, purchase the games inside of here, or at least the full versions. Here's your messaging. You can create a message pretty simple. You can type, add someone, come in here, you can type. Uh, it's T9 style, so. You can save, don't save, don't save, create. There's T9 right there. And you have T9 English and you can turn T9 English off. Go into ABC mode. Space key is the zero, so you can do. Just like so. So T9 may not be fast as QWERTY, but some of you more efficient users out there using T9 uh, word suggestion are actually fairly fast at it. So we'll back up out of here, don't save, go back into menu. We have uh, call history. There's no calls made on here, but that's what you're looking at. And again, with your organizer, calendar, alarm, to do, notes, calculator, tip calculator, world time, unit conversion, timer and stopwatch, stopwatch. And then people, you manage uh, all your different contacts, everything of that nature. web to go bring web to go up here right now. It's mostly uh, mobile browsing. It's all going to be um, mobile sites wherever you go.
gives you an introduction gives you an idea of what you're going to be paying so it's just telling you what what's going on here we go so you can search right in here uh, let's search for uh, something easy CNN There we go. CNN's already down there, but we'll just do the search anyways for it. It's fairly quick, I'd have to say. Does give you a warning. Uh, about how much you're being charged for every megabyte. So once you get it set up, it does take a little bit here. It does take a, a little bit to use the WebDO. I'm not 100% familiar with it. Uh, even with a brief time, I'm just more used to a full HTML browser. I'm more of a smartphone. Um, experience rather than this extremely mobilized version of the web so let's let's try this again all right overall the uh, call quality on the device was quite good uh, People could clearly hear me, I could clearly hear them. A little bit of static on our side, but they said it did not transfer through in our calling. Uh, we never had a signal issue with the device. And overall, as a uh, light text messaging phone and calling and a little bit of you know, mobile browsing, it works you know, fairly well. Overall, uh, if you're looking for a decent prepaid device on the T-Mobile market, the Samsung T249, that's the official name, it doesn't have a cute, clever name, uh, just its model number, the T249 it's by Samsung, is a great device for uh, T-Mobile's prepaid service and also for their uh, regular service uh, with two-year contracts. So again, I'm Tom. I'm with CellPhoneTrek.com. We're on Facebook and Twitter. Check us out there at CellPhoneTrek on Twitter and Facebook.com backslash CellPhoneTrek. Thanks for watching. I hope you have yourself a great day.